Well, I uh, got a little problem with Page Plus. They've been a very valuable and reliable system of internet connection for mobile. I, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely getting my money's worth. I, I'm, I'm not switching plans yet or anything like that, but I've had this issue since since I uh, got my first phone and first phone number with Page Plus, I logged in, registered, and uh, that phone got stolen. I uh, was able to get another Page Plus plan, phone, and all that. And that one that I didn't get real serious about, it got stolen too. Well, I finally got one that I've been able to keep without getting stolen. And I've been really wanting to log into an account. You know, and, and get personal into my account, set up auto pay, and track my usage, and all these, you know, all these, all these other things that you you get to the wonderful customer service with most places. And apparently, because I had registered my email name with another phone number, there is absolutely nothing they can do but force me to use a different email address. For my new number, and I said I, I'm a retard. I'm multiple personality disorder. This is my primary email, my primary phone, my primary phone number. I've got multiples of them, but I gotta keep them in order. I am not willing to accept this to say five dollars a month and to keep me from you know fucking on my phone on the third every month. You know, at this point, I'll just give you the money, but the personality's gone. I, I, I. I you guys are just a fucking robot now. You know that fucking owl on the page plus, the cartoon, all that fucking shit. All that fucking fancy gone. It's just fucking, I get 200 gigabytes of high speed data and unlimited low speed after that. For 30 to 31 days. For 55 to 59 depending on the auto pay and taxes. And it's worth it. Would I like more than 200 gigs? Yeah. Sure, that's really what Unlimited is all about, right? But 200 gigs works. Just barely, but it works. Um, and uh, this is what I'm getting at. $60 for 200 gigabytes, plus a cell phone service. Because it's all a hotspot, really, for me. And that's really what matters, because this phone is almost useless away from that window because of the dynamics of the metal exterior, the low signal from being out in the middle of nowhere, you know what I'm saying? And uh, this is a decent phone that seems to get the best reception out of everything I've ever had, but it's still just, I imagine they could do better. You know what I'm saying? It is just the stylus, Stylo 5. It's not, you know, the, the Samsung Galaxy S12001 or the iPhone 10XL 10 to, to 10 power to whatever the fuck and it's an LG but hey LG make the best phones and as far as I have figured out they're not involved in slave labor like iPhone and Samsung are you know what I'm saying so that's another reason why I I, I, I just I own a Nokia as a convenience item and I haven't heard anything bad about Nokia yet but I really haven't cared about them but LG, man, when I first got my first uh, LG, I want to say, and this was a pick, this was an actual, like, after having different phones, I was like, I really want a good portable computer. So I, at that point, I'd learned about how to measure processors, you know, against each other and video card graphics adapters and memories and speed and all that. And I said... Well, for the best money, the, uh, the, was it the G3 or G4, uh, the, the VS986, I think it was, or 87. Anyway, uh, the G3 was like, wow! And then when I got the G4, I was like, uh, this is it. They, they really can't get any better on the design. They can only get better on the power usage and, you know, display you know, dynamics and, and such like that. 
And I was right. This new phone, it doesn't have the batteries on the back for the volume. I've adapted to it. And it's actually easier if I want to adjust the volume loss in the clip tray. But it's just, it, it, it's, it's not like it used to be. The speaker's a little tiny thing on the side, so this big one watt, you know, is poking out the rear that could reflect off the the surface, you know, because the back was curved. I mean, just, I mean it really, man. And then, because they, they came out with that, the, the style, the, the style, the G5. And I was like, I like the idea, but it's a very fragile device. It's a, it's a very impractical device you know if you have any if you need any kind of ruggedness at all in life and um then the g6 came out and i'll be honest they still have that g6 use g6 sitting there out about nine out of ten said about that instead of the stylus five if i wouldn't have tried the stylus five out stylo five out first now that i've got stylo five that stylus in the side i don't use it very often but when i do man and, and it's a quality tool it's not doesn't feel like a dollar store fucking little dab or fucking no it's a, it, it's it's nice but um so yeah so with page plus be very careful with your email addresses and such and your phone numbers you may only get one chance to do it once i'm gonna keep working on it and try to try to solve this i mean i was talking to a human for once which is a difference i've been trying to do this over the internet and robots and machines and just i finally talked to a human but I hung up on the person. I just said, you know what? If it was, if I wasn't getting what I was paying for, I wouldn't. I'd be totally dissatisfied with this customer service and this system. And, and I just hung up. I was like, I'm gonna be switching carriers. Click. <sighs> That'd be nice if they got that recorded too. I'd love for them to be like, hey, this guy brought up a good issue. Let's see if we, we can fix it. And like I said, I'll check up on it probably next month when I. Go to try to do this again. I'll be like, look, I brought this up. I'm going to try again. Do you want to try to fucking fix my email address and my fucking phone number? And I fucking make a match so I don't fucking got to do the fucking, uh, fucking schizo and shit to keep up with everything? As they say no, I'll be like, all right, bitch. You get my fucking $60 a month, but you ain't got no fucking love or support other than just mechanics. And at this point, I'm taking advantage of you. Now, instead of 200 gigabytes a month for $60, I'm going to fucking do this shit. Because see, what I was going to do was auto pay. And then, and do my best, keep within that 200 gigabytes. And if I just literally got out of data at the end of the month, Or before the end of the month, you know, significant, you know, a few days I can handle, a few weeks I can't. I say I can't handle it. I don't want to handle it. So anyway, um, shit, I mean, we all hate it when that happens. Um, oh, anyway, so what I'm gonna do is, uh, there's 200 gigabytes. It says I'm just. Giving up on auto pay, not worth five dollars a month. I think I'm going to use this to my advantage. I'm going to get two SIM cards, two plans, two phones, but only one is going to be active at a time. And what's going to happen is, let's say I go twenty or twenty. Let's say just let's just do the third. Let's just do I do use ten gigabytes a day at the moment. Let's just say that's my average. I've been keeping it like I say closer down to the closer to that seven and a half to keep within two hundred. But let's just say I. Go ahead and just... 10 gigabytes a day is what I'm going to use. Okay, that's 300 gigabytes. That's going to require two plans a month. That's, that's $120 now instead of... The, uh, 100 Or instead of that 60. Because, again, I'm just... Fuck auto pay. At this point, I'm going to get what I want. And this is how. Let's say I use 200 gigabytes in 20 days. So that means I got 10 days of low-speed data. Well... I would just simply take that SIM card out and put my other SIM card in and then go wherever my wallet is. Click, 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 click. I'm going to do my card number. Tap. Now this phone number 
is now activated for 30 days with 200 gigabytes. My other phone number is still activated for the remainder of these 30 days, but just with low speed data. And I might even get two phones for that whole idea. So I could just, one's literally a modem and one's like the, the nicer devices will basically replace the Nokia. And that'll be even the best of all worlds. And how that'll work out though is, okay, 20 days, 200 gigabytes, I got 10 days, I activate my new card. Now that's 20 gigabyte, or 200 gigabytes for 30 days. Let's say I'm gonna do the same thing though, use that up in 20 days. Well, guess what though? That means that I still got 10 gigabytes a day, but I'm actually only paying $90 a month instead of 120. And it's very proactive. If I have a good time, so to speak, you know, or, or a good data usage time, and don't end up using a lot of data, so I'm not creating all these crazy high res videos and uploading them and not constantly streaming SD or HD, then I'll reduce my price. And the nice thing is, is I can't imagine ever going over four hundred dollars a month, uh, four hundred gigabytes a month. I can't imagine using more than twelve and a half gigabytes a day uh, uh, off of this, week, you know, off this media, mediocre cell phone signal. Um, so that means that, and I, again, yeah, you could say, all right, there is a way you could use four hundred gigabytes a month and then still be. At the end of the, even after $120, still have a few days of low speed internet. But I don't see that happening to me and not saying not reality, but this is what I could see happening. I end up using, you know, like I said, if I use up 200 gigabytes in 15 days, it's still only $120 a month. And I can always fix that by just getting a third number and a third SIM and just activating that for 30 days and then just waiting until that's out to activate the first one, waiting until that one's out to activate the second one, waiting until that one's out to activate. And I can still, I'm not paying for time anymore. I'm literally paying for data and I'm paying $60 for 200 gigabytes of mobile hotspot. If that ain't fucking clever and genius, I don't know what is. So, you know, uh, paid plus? You, you, you're just a tool now. I really don't give a fuck about your character. <laughs>